Are you wondering how to change the ownership of a workspace in Smartsheet? Well, if that's the case, you've come to the right place because today I'm gonna to be sharing with you all the steps that you need to take. So I've opened up Smartsheet here, and as you can see, I'm in the home interface. Now, what you need to do is scroll down to the browse um, section, left click, and open up what will be your kind of directory of files. So here you'll see um, the workspace section. And what I've done here before, the, uh, before I started the video is just created an example workspace. So it's a brand new workspace and I've just put in some example sheets, reports and dashboards just for illustrative purposes. Now to change the ownership of this workspace, so at the moment you'll see that I am the owner, but to change the ownership, all you need to do is click the share button. So open up the workspace, navigate to the right and click the share button. And that's gonna bring up this interface here. Now you'll see at the moment that I don't have any collaborators. So the first thing that you need to do if you want to share uh, or change the ownership of a workspace is ensure that that individual is shared to that workspace. So, you know, they might already be, um, you might have already done that. So if that is the case, then just bear with me one second. I'll just show you how you can share the workspace. So we're gonna put an example email in here. You can see I've used that email earlier. They're getting spammed at this present moment in time, that poor test account. So what you need to do is share the workspace. So put in the email. At this moment, with the permissions, you can set them as anything you like. It doesn't really matter because when you when you make them the owner, they're going to become the owner and these permissions are obviously um, at a lower level anyway. So what you do is you enter the email and then you can put in a message here. So this is for sharing the workspace. So you could put, you know, hi, I am sharing this workspace to you. Um, notify them so they get an email and are made aware of that. And you can CC yourself just to make sure they got the message. So first thing to do is share the workspace. Now, assuming you've already done that, so I'm actually just gonna press share workspace to show you the next part. So assuming you've already done that, you're gonna get this interface here. So all you need to do when you open this up is basically click, make sure you click down on here. And all you need to do here is hover over that individual or that collaborator that you want to make the owner right click, uh, sorry, left click on this drop down here and you'll see the option make owner. And if you click that, then you're gonna get this, you know, um, notification pop up here. And what's gonna happen is that, that that individual is gonna get another email that is gonna basically ask them if they want to take ownership of the workspace. So you just need to press send, send transfer request. You need to wait for them to get the email. Usually takes a couple of minutes. They'll, in that uh, email, they have a link. They'll press the link. Um, and then it will essentially update in real time and they will be the owner and you will drop down to an admin. But do bear in mind that the owner can then start changing your permissions to anything they like. So, you know, just be mindful of that. So I hope this video was useful. If it was, please do hit the like button. That tells me it was, and I should continue making videos like this. And do consider subscribing to my channel and checking it out as well. I've got a lot of videos on Smartsheet and training on the tool. So with that said, I hope you have an excellent day.